Rockets for Schools 2024 ready to proceed with launch operations this afternoon. All mission control officers and launch site monitors prepare for launch operations. Flight technician, please reset all mission control stations. Mission control operations have begun. Mission control operations have begun for the enterprise teams. All team members acknowledge your presence when called. Launch director. Present and ready. Marine safety officer. Present and ready. Air safety officer. Present and ready. Ground safety officer. Present and ready. Pad safety officer. Present and ready. Weather safety officer. Present and ready. Tracking officer. Present and ready. Public affairs officer. Present and ready. Flight technician. Present and ready. Roll call has been completed. All mission control stations check with field operations and update your status accordingly. Just one quick clarification on uh, this round of rockets. We are only launching Thomas Edison Energy, uh, team 109. So the rest of the Enterprise teams will be launching later. So this is just Thomas Edison Energy, then I'll recycle. Continuing on. All stations prepare for a status check. Launch director, status. Launch director is a go. Weather, status. Wind direction is north at a mag magnitude of 15 miles per hour. Columbus is at... 6,500 feet above ground level. Weather is go. Marine safety status. Dumper Dan's recovery vessels are in position for recovery. All other vessels are clear of the harbor and river. Marine safety is go. Air safety status. Civil Air Patrol has control over the airspace surrounding the launch area. No aircraft are in the vicinity of the launch site. Air safety is go. Ground safety status. Security has maintained control of the ground surrounding the area. No authorized parties are in the launch area. Ground safety is a go. Pad safety status. All students, advisors, and pad managers have left the launch pad area. The pads are clear of all personnel. Pad safety is go. Tracking safety status. Tracking... Recovery vessels are alert and in position. Tracking parties are in place, both land and water. Tracking safety is go. Launch director, hold the countdown clock at T minus 30 seconds. Roger. The next team to launch is The next team to launch is Thomas Edison Energy Smart Charter School from oh East their team is East Smart they are launching a Class 1 rocket on an H550 motor. Their payload consists of astonished and the heat of a motor can can produce. They are going to incorporate their rocket with popcorn kernels to identify if the heat is enough to pop them. Excellent. I'm looking forward to a snack after this flight. Launch director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. T30 seconds and counting. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, ignition. Oh, is it done?
Okay, uh, we had some radio miscommunications. We're going to do another countdown, starting with 10. And a delayed but successful launch of Thomas Edison eSmart. Okay, that was a successful, successful launch of Thomas Edison Energy. We're going to be switching over to the rest of the Atlantis rockets now. So we'll be loading the remaining five rockets from the Atlantis stream. So as soon as the rockets are on the pads, we will rebroadcast launches. Thank you. Rockets for School is 2024. We're ready to proceed with launch operations. All mission control officers and launch site monitors prepare for launch operations. Flight technician, please reset all mission control stations. That is done. Mission control operations have begun for the Atlantis teams. All team members acknowledge your presence when called. Launch director. Present and ready. Marine safety officer. Present and ready. Air safety officer. Present and ready. Ground safety officer. I'm present and ready. Pad safety officer. Present and ready. Weather safety officer. Present and ready. Tracking officer. Present and ready. Public affairs officer. Present and ready. Flight technician. Present and ready, sorry. Roll call has been completed. All mission control stations prepare to check with field operations to update your station status. All stations prepare for a status check. Launch director, status. Launch director is go. Weather, status. Wind direction is north at a magnitude of 15 miles per hour. Cloud base is at 6,500 feet. Weather is go. Marine safety, status. Dumper Dan's recovery vessels are in position for recovery. All other vessels are clear of the harbor and the river. Air safety status. Civil Air Patrol has control over the airspace surrounding the launch area. No aircraft are in the vicinity of the launch site. Air safety is go. Ground safety status. 
Security has maintained control of the grounds surrounding the launch area. No unauthorized parties are in the launch area ground safe years ago. Pad safety status. All students, advisors, and pad managers have left the launch pad area. The pads are clear of all personnel. Pad safety is go. Tracking safety status. Recovery vessels are alert and in position. Tracking parties are in place and both at both land and water. Tracking safety is go. Launch director, hold the countdown clock at T minus 30 seconds. Roger. The next team to launch is Solar Squad from Kiwaska Middle School. They are launching a Class 1 rocket on an H550 motor. Their payload consists of a solar panel that is attached to their rocket. They are going to test how much solar energy they can collect during the rocket launch. They will then determine if the solar energy can be used to help minimize the need for non-renewable resources. Launch Director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. T30 seconds and counting. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Ten, Ten nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, ignition. Excellent launch, Team 107, Kiwaskum Solar Squad. Recycle the team minus 30 seconds, hold. Next team to launch is Meet the Flintstones from Greenfield High School. They are launching a Class 2 rocket on a K535 motor. Their payload is a raw uncooked steak. After recovery, they will compare how the launch steak cooks compared to an unlaunched steak. All right, your launch director is ready for a steak. Uh, launch director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. T minus 30 seconds and counting. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Successful launch of Team 312. Meet the Flintstones. Hope your steak is good. The next team to launch is Flying Hawks from Trinity Merrill Lutheran School. 
They are launching a Class 1 rocket on an H-550 motor. Their payload will see if the gravitational pull actually adds to the speed, altitude, and or eliminates it. The average gravitational pull for RF Model 1 rocket is about 13. So our goal is to see if it stays the same, gets faster, or goes slower depending on the gravitational pull. Launch Director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. Roger. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ignition. Ooh, nice whistle. Successful launch of Team 105, Trinity Merrill Lutheran School. Uh, a note for outside, if you are standing in front of that yellow caution tape, that means you're blocking the video. Please move to the left or the right of that yellow caution tape. Thank you. The next team to launch is Erosis from Madison West High School. Their payload oh, and is a Class II rocket launching on an H550 motor. Their payload consists of a small-scale model of dispersing aerosols into the stratosphere as means of offsetting global warming by reflecting solar rays back into space. They are testing multiple methods of ejecting the powder at apogee and ejection charge. Launch director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. T minus 30 seconds of counting. T minus 20 seconds of counting. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. How come you always get bullied? <laughs> uh, hello? Okay, we're going to try recounting down that one. I think we had audio issues. So, again, Team 303, Madison West, Erosis. We're going to count down from 10. All right, we had a misfire on pad number four, so we'll come back to that one later. Let's jump to pad number five, which is team 202. The next team to launch is Mach Lightspeed from Edison Academy Magnet School. They are launching a Class 1 rocket on an H550 motor. Their payload consists of a device. The payload device is a class of miniaturized satellite based on based around a form factor consisting of 10 centimeter multifunctionality payload. The payload consists of Arduino Nano, Neo 6M, GPS flight controller, BMP 180 atmospheric pressure sensor, DHT 11 digital temperature and humidity sensor, HMC 5883L is a low mag low field magnetic sensor. MPU 6050 motion tracking device, ESP32 cam camera module, RF transmitter, and receiver modules. Launch director, all stations are go. Begin the countdown to launch. 
Roger. T minus 30 seconds and counting. T minus 20 seconds and counting. Ten, nine, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, ignition. Oh, perfect shot. Successful launch and great video on Team 202 Edison Academy Magnet School. Mock light speed. Following deployment of this rocket, uh, we will put a new igniter in Madison West Erosis. And we will be back to launch them momentarily. And we've got a good parachute on 202. Congratulations. Next rocket to launch is launch number 303, Aerosis. Launch director, all stations are go for the recycle from Addison West, team 303, Aerosis. Begin Ro the countdown to launch. Roger. T 
T-minus 30 seconds in counting. T-minus 20 seconds in counting. Successful engine, great video of Team 303 Madison West. Great job to the video crew outside. Thank you.